What's the furthest you can hit a baseball? At least 50 feet. <laughs> And this is gone. His second home run of the day. That ball is getting out of here in a hurry. Uh, and then you've got the, you know, the the, the big time toolsy guys uh, in uh, in James Woods, who's a six seven, uh, a specimen of a body. He's got big time power. He was a plus plus runner, uh, and uh, and just a, it's a good balance, good balance player. I think just building hitting routines, all types of routines, or so kind of going out my business the same every day. I think a lot of like the pressure comes from the pressure that you put on yourself. So kind of trying to just give myself realistic goals and expectations. James Wood, I just saw this kid in the Futures game. I think he's the steal of the deal. Nobody was talking about him. He flies, he's about 6'6", six, six. I mean, talent galore. We knew about the tools, we knew about the size, we knew he was a local guy from only Maryland. And over the last couple of years, James Wood has rounded into form. The tools have shown themselves at various minor league levels. And now he's on the cusp of potentially becoming the next star for this Nationals organization in the big leagues. I remember Strasburg's debut pretty vividly. I mean, especially like the hype going into it and, and how he kind of, he sort of did his thing out there, and it was pretty cool to see. I mean, I was, I was pretty young when it happened, but I remember that pretty well. It's been nice being close to home, especially a lot of these affiliates, and having my family and friends there to support me throughout, throughout the whole journey. We can hear drilled out towards deep right field, and this is gone. A home run for the third consecutive game for James Wood. I think I've learned a little bit from, from most, a lot of my teammates and a lot of my coaches. I think, I think there's some you can learn from from anybody. So I, I've just been trying my best to to pick everybody's brain and if I can, just grab any little bit of information. We saw him in spring training. I mean, he went about his business like he was a veteran player, like he'd been there before. He's already a pro and he's never stepped on a big league field in the regular season. Is the sense and the feel that I got from him, and, and uh, he's got all the tools offensively, defensively, and uh, he's going to make a big impact, I think, when he gets here. My parents, I don't make it here where I am today without them. The support they've given me and the support they'll continue to give me throughout this journey. Absolute okay. animal, 6'6", six, six, dude can run, he can make great catches in the outfield, and also the pop is real. 26 real. home runs last year. You're talking about somebody that can spray the ball all over the field. No park is too big for this young fella. I'm excited to see him continue to do his thing. Remember, he came over from the Soto trade from the Padres, so big ex expectations for this dude, but he's going to be special. I just kind of want to be myself. I want to be able to embrace the city and do what I can to support the city and, and sort of just embrace, embrace the journey.